I eat ice cream again. We talk about tracking progress, spot reduction, and how to get a faster metabolism. Ready for it? Here we go. You're looking for answers? You have questions? You don't even know what physiology is? Well, that's what I do. Right here on The Physiology Show. Here we go. Hey everyone, Jed Coverness here from JedCoverness.com and you are watching The Physiology Show. And this is episode number four. Can you believe it's been four weeks, right? Four weeks, time flies, right? Time just goes poof. Episode number four, here it comes, right? So the last three episodes have been eating stuff. And tonight I got a little bit of sherbet ice cream. Just to show you guys how real I am, right? Like, that's all it is. I eat ice cream. I I work out. I'm a father. I'm a husband, right? Like, you got to fit stuff in. That's how it works, right? You got to fit stuff in. That's just what it is. So that goes right into tracking progress. Okay, I have right here. This is the book, right? This is the book that would that will bring all it you know, all to come together right because this is every workout that I've ever created all the way up to 224 I have tracked my progress since day one of the inception of what I'm calling just workout of the day right workouts of the day itself so <clears throat> this comes down to right where's where's the ice cream where you gotta go get some ice cream, right? We're on Facebook Live, just as if you see this on recording, we're on Facebook Live, Kathy says, where's my ice cream? Go get your ice cream, right? It's totally okay to have it. Uh, tracking progress, so you gotta be tracking your progress. I don't throw tests at you within the workouts for you to just not have your, your progress. Having a journal, like this is only a piece of the pie. This is only a piece of like one journal that I keep, right? Any successful person with anything has a journal. That's it. It's plain and simple, right? If you don't have a journal, then you're not going anywhere. So the hard part about all of this is, is you need, right? You need to be writing stuff down. You need to keep track somewhere. So track your progress. Every day, whether it's an email to yourself, however that works, that's what you're looking for. So why? Why do that? Well, basically, you're in competition with who? Me? Anybody else doing these workouts? No. You're in competition with yourself. That's it. That's who you're in competitions with. And it's funny because not a lot of people realize that. They're always comparing with the outside world. Forget all that. I don't care. Doing it is the biggest part. Doing it is the best part. So what do you do, right? Where do you start? Well, you start at workout number one. Workout of the day, number one. You can head to jedcoverness.com forward slash W-O-D one. That's where you begin. It's not hard. Right, and then every workout past that, comment right on the blog post, then I know you're doing it. How crazy is that? Put, oh, Jeb, that sucked, or thank you, right? Rocking, I rocked it out today, or anything alike. And then share it out to your social media because, you know, like it's free. I do all of this for free. If you want one on one coaching, go to the coaching page. If you want to be a part of an awesome community, there's two of them. I'm a part of two of them. Check it out. But track your progress. That's how it works. Anybody who has any kind of success tracks their progress, like all the way down to the very first one. I used to write on post-it notes for crying out loud. It's okay, right? You got to find something that works for you. But tracking your progress is always proper. One of the best ways to do this. Okay, so that leads into spot reduction. What do you do, 
right? I get a lot of questions. How do I work this? What's the best way to, to lose my gut? What's the best way for belly fat? If Don't you think, and this is why I bring this up, don't you think that if I had or if anybody out there had this, this, and this, do this, then it equals this instantly, that you would lose it? Don't you think that everybody would probably just buy that and do that? And if I had that information, I would put it out there for free. There's, there's just no way to spot reduce. There isn't. And if anybody tells you that there is, they're lying. They're straight up lying to your face. There is no way to spot reduce. You can't put any pill in your body. You cannot put anything on your body to reduce, to permanently, let's, let me correct that, to permanently reduce what's going on. Impossible. Okay? Impossible. My way is not the sexiest way. My way is not the easiest way, but it's the most permanent way. Okay? That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. So spot reduction. You can't. You, If you want permanent changes, it starts here. That's how it works. That's no joke. There's no BS within that. I'm not trying to sell anything with that. It's just truth. If anybody wants to mess with that, well then, grab your ice cream and continue to eat it. Because that's how it works. And I've gotten some feedback where while I eat ice cream and you're watching this show, you grab ice cream and watch the show. Or grab something unhealthy and grab it. And that's the point. Like, I don't want to have you become unhealthy, but I'm increasing your awareness on your habits. If you watch a TV show and the commercials are flying by and they have food item after food item after food item after food item thrown at your face, you're going to go and get that food item. Simple as that. So let's talk about you know, spot reduction and tracking. And the third thing tonight is how to get a faster metabolism. First of all, probably don't want to eat a whole bunch of this stuff, but you can every now and again. So we'll lead into that. <clears throat> how to get a faster metabolism. So here's how you do it. <laughs> this is just going to blow your mind. Do my workouts six out of seven days a week. Holy, right? <laughs> I know, like pl shameless plug for my own stuff, but here's really how it works. So how to get a faster metabolism. It's called afterburn, okay? Here's what afterburn is. You have what's called a heart rate, target heart rate zone. So when you get to that target heart rate zone, there's a whole bunch of scientific what have you and whatnot that nobody cares about. What you need to know is your breathing. Get out of breath. Get completely out of breath. Get so out of breath that it equals by the time you walk up a flight of stairs, you're just like, right? Do that for at least 12 minutes, at least 12 minutes a day. And what that does is you get to afterburn. Afterburn is something also called EPOC. Exercise post-oxygen consumption. That's why we shorten it up and call it afterburn because EPOC and all that other stuff nobody gives a crap about. So afterburn, let's go back to that. So when you hit your afterburn, your body, your metabolism just increases. Okay, so you burn another 300 to 600 calories, even all the way up to 900 calories in the next 24 to 36 hours by doing nothing at all. Okay, so if you string three, four, five, six days in a row of that afterburn, three, six, nine, 12, 18, 15, 18, 
my math isn't great, right? That's 1,800 extra calories you get to burn by doing nothing. How many calories in one, one pound of fat? 3,500, okay? So if you, if you hit your afterburn six days in a row, you're about halfway there by doing nothing. I like doing nothing. Heck, I like doing nothing because then I get to hang out with my kids a lot more. And anybody with kids, we don't have time to be freaking worrying about two, three, four, five hours in the gym. We need quick. We need quick. We need stuff that works that, like this fast. As parents, that's what we need. We don't have time. Like, I'm surprised anybody would ever watch this with kids. Anybody would ever watch this or be on here, Facebook Live, you know, live because of kids, right? Nobody has time. Like, I don't go longer than 15 minutes because we don't have time. As parents, like, I got the rest of this stuff to do, right? Let me show you. Right there, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Let me show this camera, right? We got to move, right? We're trying to move and raise children and have jobs and have a life. Nobody's got time for that stuff. So you create quick, quick workouts, just like this, right? Then you track your progress. You forget about spot training. You forget about, oh, the, I don't have the, am I the, years from now, years. If you're not thinking years from now, and you're hopping on that scale every day going, oh, why can't I lose weight? If you're hopping on it every day going, oh, I worked out every day. Mm. Six months from now, a year from now, two years from now, three years from now. What does your life look like? What does your life look like? Because that, that right there is where your mind should be. Next week, nine weeks from now, 30 days from now, 21 days from now, doesn't matter. None of that matters. Because life is too dang short. Life is too dang short to be worrying about, oh, I wonder if I lost weight this week. Live in the moment. Forget about yesterday. Live five years from now, 10 years from now, 30 years from now. That's what most successful people think about and do. Create afterbirth. Forget about your spot training and track your progress. That's episode four. And there's a fly in the room. <laughs> That's just how it works. But after that, who knows what where this can happen? Who knows? Only you get to choose. Take responsibility for your own actions. Give all of this a shot. What's the worst that can happen? find progress you could hang with these workouts for a year I mean I have over 117 workouts created and posted mm -hmm. then what give yourself 365 days give yourself a full year opportunity to just do it mm -hmm. so there you go that's what I got for you today episode 4 you want to answer a question question of the day what is your favorite favorite kind of ice cream but other than that if you're willing to change from the neck up you will change from the neck down i believe in you now it's your turn start believing in yourself want to get on my newsletter i send it out every day you get an inspirational or motivational message workout you get a free workout and you get a session for me i do talk therapy every day it's kind of cool i mean it's just something where it helps you evolve out loud it just helps you change the way you feel in here and in here and anything else you'd ever want and then past that i include right here the physiology show everything that i learn i put on my newsletter anytime that i have awesome conversations is within that newsletter because i reply right back to it 
I love the conversations that I'm having with people on, on my list or on my newsletter. It's awesome. They're good people. Why can't that be you? And that's for free. Otherwise, stay safe out there. Be blessed. Bye for now. To the ask. Like, comment, and share. Subscribe. Sign up. Do whatever it is you need to be doing. Where that button's down here, or over here, or up there, or over here. Doesn't matter where the button's at. Just push it. Push the button. <laughs>